What up, y'all? Eric Creel, the Reviewer King in Established 2002, and I here today to review the film The Emoji Movie. So let's get started. So the plot for the film, we have Gene, who wants to become the owner of the man emoji, and when suddenly when Gene found out about this, when Gene needs the help to find a way to get some real but suddenly when Gene had something with emoji issues and then suddenly when Gene needs to help with high five and they like to find a way to need your help with jailbreak. And then when suddenly when Gene high five and jailbreak, this is the Candy Crush. And then when suddenly happens is when Gene jailbreak and high five want to find a way. And it's pretty much like a venture mission to find Alex's smartphone to get fixed. And then suddenly when Gene Jailbreak and High Five doing some Just Dance. And then when suddenly when Gene Jailbreak and High Five who wants to escape the Just Dance app when it's deleted. And then suddenly when it's permanently move. And then suddenly when the High Five is stuck in the deleting or the garbage can. And then when suddenly, when Gene Jailbreak and High Five, who want to save High Five at all costs. And then suddenly when Gene Jailbreak and High Five, who want to find a way in the Dropbox to find Alex, first time to help to text with Addy. And then when suddenly when Gene jailbreak and high five who want to find a way and then suddenly when the robots who wants to capture Gene and then when jailbreak whistles the Twitter bird and then they like to fly away into the fauna with a new kind of fun. And then when suddenly when Gene jailbreak and high five who wants to stop sacrificing from getting fixed. Soon as Smiler is defeated, when Gene, who wants to save his parents and also the friends, high five and jailbreak. And then Gene become the right face to save. And then to become the owner of the good emoji site. And then at the end, when Gene, jailbreak, and high five are doing the dancing sequences. And then suddenly, when Gene, jailbreak, and high five are having fun, and then that's the rest. And the post credits when Smiler is wearing braces at the end, and then that's the rest for the plot. What do I think of the Emoji Movie, in my personal opinion? It's awesome! This film's that I like that everyone hates. Yeah. Also, I do respect Lambo Rock Strikes Back, Inside of Phantom Pals 1, Harry Thomas Pictures, Jacob Stout, even Mighty Pups Fanboy, and even Matthew Davis, and the Black Critic Guy, and the rest of the peoples and the good users who do not like the film that other peoples respect others' opinions. In my personal opinion for the Emoji Movie, it's even funnier than a nut job to Night by Nature. Even though this film came out two weeks before the Nut Job 2 Night by Nature come out. I just saw the day I saw in 3D way back when on July 29th of 2017. And it's so funnier. It is based on the emojis from the smartphone. And then I bought it on Blu-ray and DVD way back when on October 2017. And then I give it a watch for my high school. It's awesome. And I finally watched that on my Jaden's Movies in the Backyard for the last year. Or the last two years, if you want to say. And then, what do I think of it? It's funny. Happy third anniversary, the Emoji Movie, in my personal opinion. Don't hate me! If you dislike the Emoji Movie, that's fine. I respect your opinion. But in my opinion, it's so silly. The animation looks pretty amazing. For a Sony Pictures animated film, the story... Pretty cool. And the characters, we have Gene, the main character. He's awesome. Played by the legendary DJ Miller. The same person who played 
Weasel from Deadpool, and also Robbie from Gravity Falls, and even this character or that character from the How to Train Your Dragon films, including Jailbreak. She's awesome. I'll pick my favorite character of all time, in my personal opinion, which is the same cast who played Sam Sparks from the first two Clyde with a Chance of Meatballs films. And then we have High Five. He's so funny. Played by the legendary James Corden, which is the same cast who played Peter Rabbit from the live action film called Peter Rabbit 2018. And then we have Biggie from Trolls. And also Trolls World Tour. And we can't forget about Gene's parents. They're nice. And even Smiler. And also, we have Smiler's Robots. And then we have Poop, played by the legendarily Patrick Stewart, which is the same cast who played Charles Xavier from the X-Men films. That is so awesome. And then we have The Devil. It's awesome. The Angel, she's awesome. And the rest of the emojis are so awesome, including the human characters. They look awesome. We have Alex, he's cool. Addie, she's nice. Wow, they look pretty nice to look at, in my personal opinion. Yeah, that's all the other characters are so awesome, including the good vibrations from Ricky Reed. That is awesome and catchy. So, no negatives and issues at all, in my personal opinion. So, if you dislike the Emoji Movie, that's fine, I respect your opinion. But, you have to respect mine, everybody. So... Overall, it gets a 10 out of 10, in my personal opinion. Amazing, brilliant masterpiece. And it gets the seal of epic masterpiece. So, and finally, I do respect Animat's opinion on the Emoji Movie. So, let me know in the comments tell me what you think about the Emoji Movie. Right, you liked it or not, but I respect your opinion if you dislike the Emoji Movie. But, and if you dislike this video... That's fine. I need to respect my opinion. You need to respect my opinion, please. So, that does it for my video, and goodbye.